Yep. No, I've been here. Before. I've been here a couple times, but the last time it wasn't uh, wasn't nice. Oh man. Talking about on Google Maps here and found this little thing. This random little cenote inlet thing. So we're gonna I think the entrance is from Spuha Beach. So we're gonna go look at that. So we're gonna go take the bus down here, cruise down, and then across and try and find that place. Let's make it. Uh. Around there, but it's like a weasel few yeah. cruise down this path. Well, let's give it a shot. No se puede pasar. No se puede cruzar, amigo. No, no se puede pasar no, por aquí. No. Ah, okay. Es propiedad privada. Privado. Yeah, sí, sí, entiendo. Está bien. Sí. We just can pass on the beach. Oh, ah, okay. Uh huh? Yeah. He's getting, I'm like, I'm like, oh, okay, so we just can't pass through here. He's like, it's private property. I'm like, okay, man, like, <laughs> take it easy. We get that, so we'll just go this way. Hopefully he doesn't run after us. He said it was okay up this way? Oh, it's so hot, the water here, man. <laughs> yeah, this is, this is the cenote. The caleta, no, that's not it. Oh, this guy's coming with a stick. Uh, it's not... his back up with a with a big piece of wood coming after us here. What are you doing? Go do that. Hey! Hey! Amigo! You want this? Come down, come hey, down. chico, estamos regresando, no? Well, that's what happens if you try and do the right thing. You get a guy with a stick coming to hit you on the arm, and he picks up a rock. He's got a rock in his hand, trying to clobber it over our head. So, the guy said we could pass for this way, and then he said, no, so we're, we're walking back, and his buddy, the chubby, Bastard comes up, starts cracking me with a with a stick. So I turned the camera off, grabbed him. But when a dude with absolutely no morals picks up a rock, you can't you can't level with him. This is absolutely ridiculous. Well, I kind of thought that because we weren't going to be able to find that little uh, cenote inlet thing, that this was going to be a very uneventful day. But that turned out not to be true. The guy, as we were walking, just so you understand what happened there, if it wasn't all on video, is we were walking the, the pathway and the guy said, no, 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 that's private property. And Matt was up and they asked him if we could go this way and he said, yeah. And then we started walking that way, he saw us, didn't do anything, and we got farther along and then he said, no, 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 you can't, that's private property too. And we were almost there and we, ah, okay, you know, we'll come back. He gets on the radio for some reason, radios his backup, which is a chubby dude with a, a weak piece of bamboo, clobbers me a couple times on the arm. I didn't actually think he was going to do anything. Walking right past him, I get a couple steps past him and like the coward he is, he clobbers me a couple times on the arm, picks up a rock and, and throws it and hits me in the hip. I don't know, not that bad, but a little, just a little red mark there. Not to get too graphic of my white thighs, but it's, it's that sort of stuff that is just so uncalled for. First of all, why is that area restricted? It's private property, whatever, fine, I'm not gonna argue with you. We're walking back and you have a guy coming to threaten to hit me over the head with a rock. I mean, figure your stuff out. But we're still in paradise. They're filming an advert, right, a commercial right beside us, so we're just going to, to post up here and go for a swim.
right, so we're back in Playa del Carmen, safe and sound, all things considered actually a decent day. The found an amazing beach, the water is incredible. And even though we didn't get to where we wanted to go to that little cenote thing, and a guy tried to smash my head in uh, with a rock, you know, it's still a pretty good day. Um, it just goes to show you can't expect some people to act rationally. You can't count on people to be normal. Uh, and that guy certainly wasn't. So, but I'm just gonna push that aside. Happy it didn't escalate more, you know, farther than where it went. And I'm happy that I'm intact, camera's intact. He tried to go and snap the little viewfinder thing off. So all's well that ends well, I guess. Um, if you guys wanna learn more, about doing this, about being able to travel, have an online business and make money while you're doing things that you want and not having to report here and there and partner with a company that has training, products, everything provided. You know what to do. Click the link below, put in your information and make sure you subscribe so you stay in touch with all the videos to come. Hopefully not quite like this one today, but again, guys, if you want to do this and live a more exciting life, you got to click below, get the information, build something of your own, live a no regrets lifestyle, guys. Again, thanks for watching. Click below, write some comments if you have any, give it a like, subscribe, and I'll talk to you guys soon. No regrets.